A break-in leads to fraudulent credit card use, but that's only a small part of what has police concerned about this crime. Michael Burke has more about the other item which was taken from that car in this week's LEX 18 Crime Stoppers. What's become an all too routine car break in during the overnight hours has Lexington police on high alert this time. Right after uh, they stole the credit cards within just a couple of hours, he was already using those credit cards at the Kroger on Lowry Lane and then also here uh, behind me at Meyer on Reynolds Road. But that's only of minor concern to police now when compared to what else was taken from that vehicle, the car owner's gun. Uh, they know that there's a, always going to be a market out there for firearms and again it puts police officers and civilians lives in danger because that's one more firearm out there on the street in the hands of somebody that shouldn't have it. Legally purchased and registered, so that's the good news. We'll know the serial number, the make, model of that firearm, where it was manufactured. We know everything about that gun. But they'll first need to talk with these people to find out where that gun might be now. That's a common recurrence, and common sense would help alleviate a potentially dangerous situation, if not a tragic ending. If you have a gun in the car that you need to go ahead and take that out and take it inside with you, you're gonna remember that that gun is in that vehicle or anything else of value. The victim of this theft had his hidden. Clearly, that didn't matter. They're going to go through your consoles, your glove box, under your seats, the pockets in the backs of your seats. They have time. Now they have someone's gun as well. Or what's potentially worse, someone else may have it. Covering Crime Stoppers in Lexington, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News. If your information leads to an arrest, you could get a cash reward from Bluegrass Crime Stoppers. Just call 859-253-2020 or text your information to crimes by putting Lex PD in the message along with your anonymous tip.